For the past 20 years, LED bulbs have been one of the greatest inventions we've ever had, and of course they use less power, but the best feature of all is the lifespan. These bulbs can claim that they can last up to 21 years. Many people who purchased some original bulbs way back in the day may still have them working today. When those first bulbs were created 20 years ago, those manufacturers wanted this technology to take off, so they really overbuilt those bulbs so the consumers would love them and of course keep buying more. But then fast forward to today and things get really shady. On every bulb that you're buying, there is a warning that if you don't pay attention to it, that your bulb will literally self-destruct. Now, as we zoom in, you'll catch the phrase that says, not for enclosed fixtures. But what exactly does that mean? Does it even matter? Well, an enclosed fixture is a big deal when we're talking about LED bulbs. Now, when we look at our home, we have all different types of light fixtures, but this single phrase is literally admitting that this bulb will self-destruct if you ever use it in a fixture that is enclosed. For instance, this one on my ceiling is certainly enclosed. The bulbs are within the glass globe and it is essentially sealed. Though it's not airtight, it is closed from having a lot of extra air circulation. What about these types of fixtures? All of the sides and the top are covered, but the bottom is open. Similar fixtures exist in your bathroom, but even more so, look at your ceiling fan light. You've got a bulb inside that plastic lens, making this one a fully enclosed fixture. Now this phrase or warning is super important because essentially what it is telling you is is this bulb has the potential to die so much earlier than what you actually expect. In fact, many of these bulbs will literally just last six to eight months if you put them in an enclosed fixture. In fact, if we go to the manufacturer's page, they're gonna tell you clearly that if you put one of these bulbs in any type of a closed-in fixture, that it will severely reduce the lifespan of the bulb. These bulbs will not last nearly what they say on the box if you're using them in anything less than a perfect environment. And if you have two bulbs in an enclosed fixture, they'll actually fight against each other and that heat will destroy the other bulb. One of the bulbs will die quickly and the other one will last much longer. But what about these other fixtures where the bulb is still covered by sides but the bottom is open? Well, the good news is the bulb will last longer but you are still retaining far more heat than the bulb is really designed for and you will get a much shorter life. You also want to consider how often you use the light. You could use these bulbs in a fully enclosed fixture but if you only use them for five or 10 minutes a day, it is very unlikely that that bulb will die sooner. And unfortunately, these manufacturers kind of get away with this because they've put this phrase on the bulb, but most of us have never noticed it or really have any understanding what the actual impact is. Now, of course, in a perfect world, you can have a lamp like this where the bulb is totally wide open. These are the situations where this bulb should last the full maximum stated lifetime that the manufacturers put on the package. But there is a secret you want to be aware of. You want to look for bulbs that actually state the opposite it, they will say clearly that they're rated for enclosed fixtures. But what allows a bulb to work inside of an enclosed fixture? And why don't they just make them all like that? Well, of course, the answer, unfortunately, is money. Those original bulbs from 20 years ago all worked in enclosed fixtures or high heat situations just fine. But as they cheapen the products over the years, they essentially remove those higher quality components. But if you look for bulbs that specifically state for enclosed fixtures, your light bulb should last the stated amount that's on the package. 